point. I call it the rape tape because he did certain things to me that were on tape that I realized after the fact were content for a pornography tape. Okay. And you're saying you weren't in your right mind when it was done. Like, you know, anal, uh, cum shots, okay, certain areas. I don't know the details of these You just read my Christmas list. (laughs) But I'm saying, like, if you don't know that, what's happening. Put the headphones on. Let's Let's get this done right now. Uh, X-Pac. Hold on, put your head. Hey there. Hey, buddy. Uh, I, saw you, I saw you tweeting us, so, uh, yeah. I, I, well, I'm, I'm, I, I couldn't hear what was being said, but, like, people were filling me in. And it just makes me sad, you know? I thought we could be over this stuff by now. It's been so many years, and, you know, I mean, just to keep focusing on the past is just is, is bullshit. I mean, it's not bullshit. It's just, it's just, I mean, it's, fuck, how can you go forward when you just keep fucking, you know, harping on the past? Plus, I mean, I didn't fucking rape anybody. I've never done such a thing in my life. I mean, I can understand how she feels, you know, victimized in a lot of ways. I mean, you know, I mean, looking back, I was just, look, I I was a pretty pathetic fucking boyfriend. I was all fucked up on drugs. I wasn't perfect by any means, but I never abused anybody. Um, uh, We did fight a lot. Um, and, and I, and I apologize for the, for my, uh, for my shit, you know, um, geez, can we not fucking put this shit behind us? She, she's claiming that the tape was released without her knowledge, but she had custody of it and I can prove it. And, and, uh, I, this guy, Fred Sherman, he has the canceled check, a hundred thousand dollar advance that she got and the contract she signed. Do you want to comment? Because she said, "Do you want to comment on it, so at least address it, so last- people have your opinion?" Yeah. And when was the last time you guys two, uh, you two talked? It's been it's been years. It's years. been years. Okay. Yeah, and I don't want to. I don't, look. The last thing I want to do is bring all this shit up. I don't want to. I don't want to pile on her. She's been through enough shit, you know. Um, and 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 I regret. And I and I totally regret our friendship being ruined over this shit. You know. I mean, it's just. Come on, Johnny. Come on. Johnny, what do you got to do? Comment. Let, her, let, her, yeah. let her comment back. To, uh... Well, first of all, when there's people around you that are saying, sign this or sign this to, you do it. And you don't ask. So, therefore, I don't know what, you know, I don't have a lawyer looking over every single thing that I'm doing, you know. I shouldn't have to do that. Yeah, we were both we were both not in any kind of shape to really be signing anything. I mean, but the fact is, we okay. Did. And if that's that's part of the case, that's an, that's another factor. If I wasn't in the case, the if, right I, set of if mind. I wasn't in the right set of mind to sign something put in front of me, then I shouldn't sign well, it. I mean, right? I, you know what I mean, let, we were let, both let me just, out. Let can me I just, ask you this? Did you guys? Sorry, I, didn't, I didn't mean to interrupt you. I apologize. Let, 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 let me just say this. Yes. I'm going to take the high road on this because what happened after speaks for itself. People can assume or make judgments, whatever they want, but those were the facts. It's how it affected my life afterwards. I'm going to deal with it. I'm dealing with it. I'm going to move on. and I'm going to be happy. I do my deal. Mind, body, spirit, and surround myself with the best freaking people around me. Who want only the best for me and love me and care for me. And I'm going to know it without having a and, second and, doubt. And you, you you may not believe this, but I want the best for you too. And I want you to be happy. Sincerely from the bottom of my heart, Johnny. Do you think there's any validity that he would have trouble taking advantage of you if he was as fucked up as you were at the time? You know what I mean? Like I his decisions you, would have been I've as never bad as dr- yours. I've never put a drug in your drink. I have never given you a drug you didn't know about. Any drugs we took, we both were very uh, willing to do so. Well, I wasn't. I willing would to never do, do that to you. I promise you. I'm not that my promise might probably doesn't mean shit to you, anyways. But it it is true. I, I never did. What kind of what kind of drugs were you guys doing back then? Well, I mean, I don't want to fucking, I don't want to throw her on, you know, like okay. if she wants to tell you what kind of drugs she did. Do you want to tell uh, us? So, so your GHB never played a factor in anything? 
I never G- we I never GHB'd you. We both took GHB. No, we didn't. No, we didn't. Not those yes, like. Yes, we did. No, oh. Yes, we did. No, oh, I don't yes, know. I wasn't did. a part of that franchise. You used to have it when we worked in WWE. The, the fucking yellow bottles. No, I'm, that's not what I'm talking about. That's GHB. That's not what I'm talking about. So no, I mean, but the, and we took it, and we and we also took it while we were together. No. What are you talking yeah, we about? We did. We took. All right. If you're not going to be honest, here's what we we did. I'm talking about what? something that he had going with somebody else. With I didn't have anything going with GHB else. that that's I had it. never seen, and I looked true. the other way and never spoke a word of it. What are we going to say? I don't understand. Sean? I don't get that. I don't get what you're. I don't. I don't understand what you're getting at. Like, I had something going on with somebody else involving GHB. I had, I had nothing going on with anybody else that you didn't know about. Spell it. It's just that the thing is, when people what? are doing coke, when people are doing cocaine and crystal meth, we get a little bit paranoid. You and were, I even thought and, look, we, you yourself, even, and you. And don't 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 even try to say you didn't do math. Listen, Sean, you are on. Your drugs were trauma traumatizing to me. I've never seen any human being. I don't even know what half the stuff you were taking, and the what right. so, that was traumatizing no, no, no. to me. I try, and I and I tried and I tried to hide my. It's when we first got together. The fucking funny part about it was, is we were hiding our drug use from each other. I wasn't. No. Mine was my my mine was far worse. But you Listen, were doing you know coke. What? Listen, you were doing a little bit of coke, but you were doing good. Like I was the one that was fucking. Sean, up. I, I, I own I own what I do. I've been really very real about what I do. Uh, in the public, then and now, I have no problems going there. Okay. I mean, uh, I mean, we shouldn't have a problem. I mean, it's the past, and, and if you own your shit, then it's easier to get over it. She also, well, I mean, I just, that's... She, she also accused you of being with dudes. With dudes? Oh, you know who else told me that? When she was in um, uh, Celebrity Rehab, my, my friend Rico Rodriguez, former UFC heavyweight champion, said that she was saying that on the on the show, but they wouldn't play it. No, I really do it in my life, except when I was fucking molested as a child. Does that count? Uh, I don't no, think I'm that counts. Now, I would never make now, fun now, of when, that. Now, now, when we were together, and when we would watch porn, she'd want to watch gay porn, and she used to make innuendos. So, like, I like mean, what innuendos? Maybe she wanted me to be with dudes. I don't know. Oh. No, I just think it was like, if you don't know anything about that weird drug culture, like, you know, when George Michael was going to the bathrooms yeah. and like, Jimmy was you there. know, mm-hmm. Sean would make the late night, late night trips to Ralph grocery store. And like the designer that, you know, the gay designer that was making all my clothes and, you know, he was making visits there and they were doing drugs together. Yeah. Allegedly. No, I never did drugs with Cosmo. He was a, he was a bit of a nut. But um, no, there, he's like, he, he was oh, not. Hey, he was crazy. So, Xbox seems pretty okay, believable. Okay, well, you said his no, name. I didn't. No, but, but, <laughs> Blew up Cosmo. Yeah, spot. Yeah. Sorry, Cosmo. I don't know who Cosmo is. Cosmo either. Kramer. Never Sorry heard about that Cosmo. Yeah. Don't know. No, but and 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 she and and what she just said, like I was so whacked out. Like I'd go like to to Ralph's grocery store and be like in the wine aisle or something for like two three hours, and I I've can understand how. And I and I could because I was so whacked out, you know, and I didn't even realize that like my perception of time was so whacked out. I can totally understand how she. Uh, I'm just saying it was sometimes a little weird. Oh, sure it was. Oh. I'm sure it was. Sorry, I'm sure it was. I'm totally of, sure it was. A lot of questions in bizarro world there. <laughs> Yeah, I just think it's just silly that we're still at each other. Like, I mean, I, come on, can we not? Can we not squash this? Like, like, like I said, I'm taking the high road on this, but I assure you, there was nothing silly about any of that. Not to me. Yeah, it seems like no. A, I can, I, and I understand that. She, like, you, she, you really went through some shit. You really did. She really believes you put something in her drink. 
and I, uh, I, on the on the on my children's life. But that, but that, but no. those were the times when he he put something in my drink. Those were the times when he was calling the cops and saying his that I was beating him and his kids were there and he was moving in and crashing my cars and me up in front of my kids it was it's a, it's a, there's a police report and you admitted it to the cops that's why they took you to jail there's a restraining order you beat him in front of his Panama. kids there was a there was a temporary restraining order that you fabricated this this report and then you wouldn't even show up to court to get the permanent restraining order because it was all a bunch of lies and you're full of shit yeah i that's that's true. I didn't show up to court. I was petrified. I was but did petrified. you beat him in front of his kids? You were so kids? petrified. No, you were so I got petrified. An, I, got an emerg- no, I, I got an emergency restraining order after like the umpteenth time of him choking me and taking me down and breaking my ribs and breaking my hip, That's taking bullshit. me in the hip. And so I finally That's got bullshit. the restraining order, but I was scared to get the restraining order because he kept coming back. And No, you had me back. And I, that was I, right after... That was right after the O.J. Simpson and the Anna, Anna okay. and the, Nicole, Spence. Nicole Brown. And okay. so the laws yeah. were changing. Then, then the laws were changing. They, they take you both, they take okay, you both sorry, to jail if there's a domestic yeah. dispute. They take you both to jail. And believe me, when you're going through all that, and then this happens, and you call the cops for help, and then you both get taken to that Twin Towers after. Jail in when, Los Angeles. When we both went to jail, that was after. Are you that was after your kidding me? Report. All of it, all of it. And so then, when I was let go, the police officer there said, "You're gonna get that restraining order, China." And I went and I got the restraining order. And of course, yeah, Sean was waiting there with with, some with of watches and notes and jewelry and saying he was life. sorry. And Wait, what did he say? He said uh, she filled it up with uh, some of the biggest crock oh of God. shit he'd ever read oh. in his fucking I was, life. I, I was served it, but I never read it. And then, like a day later. She has me come back, and I'm banging her. Fucking <laughs> two days, be- two days before the fucking the real fucking restraining order thing. So I show up to court, and she doesn't. No, you weren't banging me, so and I was she, petrified. If you, were so, I went to my- if you were so scared of me, why'd you keep bringing me back and having sex with me, Sean? I, at that time, at that time, you were coming back, and then shortly after that, that's when they came to pick you up to go to rehab. The guys. Oh, and we talked. Shortly, yeah. shortly after that and is when boy, we we were both completely whacked out. No, we no, we up. weren't. I was, I was. Yeah. No, I was chasing you around. Like you I was, were I was me mad. Around. I couldn't. I, I was only one place. I was in the downtown L.A. Hilton. You knew where I was, and I never left. So you came to my, you came to my room. Yeah, I wanted. I had. Well, you know what? I had a problem because because she thought because she was so paranoid, she thought I was having sex with this uh, with this lady that owned the store on Melrose, some Persian lady. That was complete bullshit too. She thought I was having sex with everybody, men, women. She thought I stole all her money. It's possible too. <laughs> I don't know. She, 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 I, mean, I mean, have you talked to your sister? Do you still think she stole all your money too? She did say that before. Yeah, you guys were bullshit. you guys were talking to each bullshit. other. You you know what? You would probably know more about that situation than I would, Sean. All I know is your your family loves you. She was, you she, listen, no fucking reason. everybody seemed to take your phone calls, but they don't take mine. Isn't that amazing? I, don't talk, I haven't talked to them. I just know how much you it's hurt them. It's just amazing. You know. Hey, look, all, look. all I'm speaking is the truth, and you're full of shit. Whoa. I'm sorry. I don't mean to be a dick. But I tried, I, I'm trying to suck in men's senses, and you just keep spewing these fucking lies. And Hunter never hit you. Hunter never hit you. You told me he just pushed you out of the way because you were all up in his face and trying to get him to hit you. Oh, I must not have remembered that, Sean. Maybe that was the other China on Twitter. Of course you're not going to, of course you're not going to remember it. Of course, and and not to mention the the uh, people you accused of gang raping you. That was a bullshit story too. You told me. You told what, me that. You admitted it to me. The fucking story in your book is bullshit. What story is that? I'm not familiar with that. Right. Yeah. That she was gang raped. The the fucking story that she told me was she got too drunk and took on the fucking basketball team and woke up the next day and was so fucking uh, 
and was so embarrassed that she accused people of gang raping her. That's the fucking truth. I wrote the book. She told me that. Read the book, Sean. Did you tell him that? No. It's in the book. <laughs> I'll take a lie detector. Look, I live in Philly. I'm not far from your studio. I'll show up. You get a lie detector in there. I'll take a lie detector over every single fucking thing that I've said. And I will pass it. I guarantee you. Well, we got tomorrow's show. Will you? <laughs> we got tomorrow's show. Well, you will know. you? Well, you, Joni? I don't know. Would you take a lie detector uh, test there, Joni? I think I've taken enough. She held up her you arms. You haven't she, taken a fucking lie detector she, she, test I ever. Think she was, she was uh, showing us her arms where she committed, to, tried to commit suicide. I don't need to defend myself anymore to you, Sean, or to anybody else. It's simply not a yeah, debate. Yeah, but I need to defend myself to you. Did you hear you that? It's lie. not a debate. You fucking accuse me of rape? You accuse and me I of rape? Deserve, if I wanted to be a dick, after I'd all of this, fucking dime you have. to tell my side. And I'm uh, glad that I'm here to be able to be in the space to do that right now. It, and it's, and it's hard. Is there anything, I'm, I got to ask you this just as a person interviewing you. Is there I'm any, sorry I'm getting all worked no, up. No, 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 no that's fine, man. No, that's okay. As a person, like, you know, obviously relationships and people get very angry and upset and they feel used and they feel uh, violated and they feel like they want to get back and be vindictive. Is there, is there anything that you have lied about in, in a moment where you felt like, I have to get back at this person, and then it's spun out of control. No, I, I'm not a vindictive. Um, yes, yes. Are you I'm talking to me? No, no. I was asking. I was asking uh, China. No, I don't feel that way. Like I said, I'm. I'm. I would rather not spend the rest of my life dealing with the things that were so hurtful for to me. To me, I just want to move on. I want to be happy. I don't want to be in yeah, that pain. You know, so you I don't want to spend the rest of my life being vindictive. However. Lies. I don't want to be persecuted and make like I'm some monster after all of it happened on top of it. That's not no okay. Make a monster out of you it's not you okay that it happens in the first place lives. and that this stuff happens and women so often, just women in general, you know how many women are going through this and they don't, they're not able to have a voice or not able to tell the truth or they're not, they don't feel uh, don't protected pretend, uh, or they don't, don't feel pretend. safe. And it happens Please, over and over again. Look, when you make up bullshit... And the reason that they're, they're not well, able talk. to talk about Is it... okay if I talk for one second? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, 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 same yeah. reason. When, you make, yeah. when you make up bullshit lies about people abusing you and about people uh, raping you, you do not represent women that have been abused. You are a fraud if you think that you represent women that are abused. I advocate people that have been sexually abused. And I fucking and and I've never abused anybody in my life. I think you guys should get back together. <laughs> Boy, could you fucking imagine that? <laughs> <laughs> That'd be the greatest uh, reality show I've now, watched the shit out of you that. You know how long it's been? Do you know how long it's been since we've even seen each other or talked to each other? And look at look at what it's look what it's erupted erupted into. And I really wanted to have a nice conversation. Now, I really did. I want to go back to the sex tape uh, quickly because that's what really started the downward spiral for China. And you're you're here to say that. And I, uh, and I understand that. And you you're here the to say that the artwork, the artwork they put on there was so awful. And I can understand how figuratively she felt raped just by looking at that fucking artwork. But Sean, you're was, claiming different things than she is. Yeah, you're claiming that you guys negotiated this deal together. We did. Mm. We did. That's a fact. That's a fact that, be, that can be corroborated, corroborated by David Joseph of Red Light District. Uh, uh, I don't even know Fred who that Sherman. is. Was this around the drug time, though? Is this back when y'all was doing more drugs? We weren't that fucked up. We knew what was going on. Okay. We were just fucked up. Your decision, look, you make stupid decisions, but you're still responsible for your decision. Well, what were yeah. you guys thinking at the time as far as, you know, getting this sex tape out there? What would it do for both of you? I don't know. It's just like somebody... My, my my memory of it was, was there was this lady that worked at our apartment building that kind of planted the seed, and it just went from there. Like, I don't want to blame it all on her, but she was definitely game for it. Did she know it was going to be an adult film that was released? Of course. Of course. Because you want to know why? The original footage, footage wasn't enough. 
So they wanted more, and we did more, just like the fucking Love and Hip Hop. Oh, thing. just like the Love and Hip Hop Mimi's tape. Yes. Hmm. Maybe, maybe China admits so this today, and then you can move on, China. Conscientiously, conscientiously, we both yeah. made more footage. He, so how can that be fucking right? Xbox sounds very believable, uh, China. You want to maybe, because maybe, I'm maybe, the truth. maybe, true? maybe you admit that today, and then uh, maybe that will help you move on. I don't know. You'd have been better yeah. off if you have just went on and not and not told bullshit lies. Everything would have been fine in this interview. Look, you know, like I said, I think. At this point, I've done very well taking the high road. I s- said what really. I need to say. I'm glad you said that. I said what I need to say. <laughs> you don't need Jesus. to take the high road. You just, you should, whatever just, it is, just, that's the truth. Yeah, whatever is the it's truth. Not, and it's not funny. It's not, it's not funny. That was a little humor. No, it's, 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 <laughs> it's, not, humor, it's right. not funny, but it's better than crying because it's so fucking sad, Johnny. You did more. You did more for the empowerment of women than Billie Jean King. Like before, there was a Ronda Rousey. There was a China. I agree. You know, and 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 fucking. Do you want your defining moment to be all this bullshit? You still have a chance to come up out of it, but you gotta let this bullshit go. Guess woman. what? This is not changing my defining moment. That's what I decided from here on out. Yeah, but as long as you hold on to this shit. No. If that's what's going to be. People are going to remember but it that. Ha- it, it, but it has been. It has been for the last, you know, however many years defining me. And I'm not going to yeah, let that happen. but it doesn't have to. So. If, it, if, you, if you wouldn't have been fucked up in a fucking train wreck for fucking TMZ to fucking make fun of us for a couple of years and then lied on fucking Dr. Drew and couldn't even admit you're a drug addict, I don't know how he could even treat you. Fucking, I, I can't even believe it. You couldn't even fuck. You can't even be honest with yourself. Yeah, she told us she uh, never had a problem with drugs and alcohol. That's a fucking biggest lie of all time. I have fucking proof of it. Proof. What kind of proof? Fucking witnesses that sold us the shit. What? Witnesses, you said witnesses that, sold. that sold the stuff to you. Sold what stuff? I guess drugs. the drugs. Oh. Is that true? The white girl. The, the white girl, the fucking, the, uh, the, uh, uh, Smirnoff. That was us. That was the code names. Don't act like you don't remember. You know, but here's the thing. Like I was in Hollywood. I drank. I got messed you drank up. You drank your fucking pack, your nose full of fucking Coke. I did Coke. You gotta be in Hollywood you know? for that. <laughs> I'm a testament. Wait, what? You know, it not was that that's the worst. Not it that was that's part the worst of, thing in the world. It was part of an but, experiment. Wait, let me finish. It was part I'm of experiment of an experimentation. You no, know, we did with the girls. I did a little bit, but listen, you t- were way over my head. A different level. Okay, that w- that was just like I agree a hundred percent. You know, I agree a hundred percent. But he's, he's and, right though that if you were me, doing coke, you were doing coke. It is what it is. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Right. But don't lie about it. Fuck. There's a difference li- between not, doing wait, wait, coke and doing I never coke. lied about that. And when you're, when you know, when you're partying <laughs> or whatever, you're doing a little bit. Yeah, of but something. you're lying about never doing that. When less. you're doing a little bit of something, right? And then you see somebody doing something so monstrous that you're like, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're on a different level you here. You were doing the exact same shit as me, except I was doing it a lot and a lot worse than nothing. So and that a, was a big part. I mean, I, here's the thing. I was going, hiding my drug look, use from her. We're going round and round in circles here. Was he the guy like uh, you? You would do coke. Were you doing, if you were doing meth, you were doing meth. Were, were you look at him and go like, if I ever get that bad, I'll stop. Was he like the guy that no, you would look at? Just, no, it wasn't an issue. No, was it was just on, I, was fuck, I would just like have my, like little, get my little party on. But, you know, the amount of time that that lasted, because this scared me straight. Let me tell you, yeah. you know. Yeah, well, when we're having hallucinations and seeing fucking uh, demons and UFOs and you think you were abducted by aliens, I think something's fucking wrong. You mean when you were locked in my bathroom on various times? Well, we were both we were both, we were both experiencing that shit. Where the fuck was I when y'all was partying yeah. like this? <laughs> shit, I missed out. She thought she was... Oh, damn it! That's called, that's called a lot of... It's called a lot of stimulants. And a lot of and a lot of sleep deprivation. Yeah, it so was really crazy. She thought she was being abducted by aliens. 
she thought she was at one point. Wow. And fuck, I, I believe that. I, I wish so that I would be abducted. But did you think you were being did you think you were being abducted? No. I know I did a couple times. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, yeah. Were you anally probed by the yeah, aliens? I guess I, I guess I all of a sudden just started lying about this, right? He sounds like he's. I mean, I don't know either one of you that well, but he sounds you like he's, sounds he's being both sounds sincere, and I think it was just so druggy and sleep deprived that all the stories are mixed up and souped out. You oh don't man, know I, was, what? I was sleep deprived for many years. You know, oh, were you doing with one eye open? Were you, you know? were you doing more drugs than you let on at first? No. Okay. Sounds like it. Though. Oh my god, I can't. No, I still in... can't believe you, you won't admit it. I was in no. That's the first. That's like one of the first steps to something getting better. No, I was. No, you need to get better then. I, 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 I just, am better. I, assume, I am better. I'm sober. I assume that China was uh, on some heavy stuff. But you the, never know. Years. If you're doing drugs, though, you don't know how much the other person in the room is doing, too. Because I'll get high and be like this. We fucked up. Right. <laughs> and you realize you're the <laughs> only one. me. <laughs> yeah, but also. That's true. That you're no, it's not really party. crazy. Like, it, it was no longer partying. It was just isolating. She's right. I'd hide in the bathroom because I was shooting it. I was oh. I was using needles. Yeah, no, she was doing the same thing as me. She was just snorting it. Okay, look, I've so been was, hanging was, in here pretty good. But needles is we, more hardcore you know, though. Than let's, let's 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 just okay. let's cut it here, you know, because mm -hmm. it's enough. That you know, intense. I said my That's do fine. my do. Sean, you can you can do your do on another day. Okay, good luck to you. Good luck to you. I I really and honestly truly wish you the best. I just I'm not going to be accused of rape and all this other shit. But and, and I but I sincerely wish you the best. All right. So you want to make it clear that you never raped uh, anyway. China or anyway, anyone. Yeah. You want to make it clear you never slept with dudes. You want to make it clear never. you never put something never. in a drink. And you want to make it clear that you both uh, negotiated the sex tape together. I think that's that, that's everything. Those are right? the things he wanted to say. It's yeah. X Pac stance. Yes, X Pac. <laughs> uh, you got to come on the show. And soon. I'm willing to back that. And I'm willing to back it up with with a polygraph. Okay. Do I don't you know, know how much they cost, but you know, I'll fucking I'm pay more, for it. I'm more than willing to. <laughs> <laughs> we'll do it tomorrow. <laughs> All right. Thank you, man, hey, for calling. We appreciate I can, it. I can hop on the Amtrak. I'll be there in a minute. <laughs> all right. We'll uh, we'll be in touch. All right, Xbox. Thank, thank you, guys. Thank you so yeah, much I for really calling the show, Sean. Best, Johnny, I really do wish you the best, Sean. Thank you, guys. Okay. All right. Wow. What that the was, fuck is up with y'all? That was explosive.